Hello friends, welcome back to our channel Footech360. Today's notes is on the topic Inert Gas Packaging. Inert gas has been used in the food processing in a variety of ways. The objective of the present review is to compile the different applications of inert gas in food processing and the possibility of low oxygen atmosphere processing. Inert gases are so stable and react so little because, unusually for elements, the number of electrons in the outer part of the atom completely fills the shell. Inert gases are used as a passive preservative in contrast to active preservatives. Nitrogen, argon, helium and carbon dioxide and common components of inert gas mixtures can also be used for special purposes. Nitrogen has nearly the same weight as air and the other are heavier. If nitrogen is the only gas used in the packaging then it is called as inert blanketing. Now let's see the methods for flushing inert gas into packages. There are mainly two methods. One, gas flushing. Two, gas flushing with compensated vacuum. Let's see one by one. One, gas flushing. The gas flush process is usually performed on a form fill seal machine. A continuous stream of gas is injected into the package to replace the air by diluting the air in the headspace surrounding the food product. When most of the air has been replaced, the package is sealed. Typical residual oxygen levels in gas flushed packs are 2 to 5 percentage oxygen. The gas flush technique is not suitable for the packaging of very oxygen sensitive foods. The great advantage of gas flush process is speed since it is a continuous operation. Flushing with nitrogen has been introduced to extend the shelf life of beverages. The benefits of flushing cans with nitrogen include increased shelf life, retention of product aroma and reduced can corrosion. Two, Gas flushing with compensated vacuum. The compensated vacuum process first applies a vacuum to remove the air from inside a container holding the food and then introduce the desired gas or gas mixture via lances or pots. Machines designed to perform this operation are of the chamber variety. Since this is a two stage process, the speed of operation of the equipment is slower than the gas flushing technique. Because the air is removed by vacuum, however, the efficiency of the process with respect to residual air levels is much superior. Lectures and quizzes related to food packaging as given in the description. For more updates and study materials, you can join us on our telegram channel, Facebook and Instagram. Link is in the description. If you found this video helpful, like this video and share this information to your friends. To see more videos like this, please subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon so that you never miss a video from us.